the euro and the US dollar market today, there is a strong trend trending up, as you can see in the screen. And there are multiple entry opportunities leading to a good profit. So let's have a look uh, on where they are. First, after the London Open, it is a high and low and high. Whenever it is making high or lows, and uh, you want to uh, draw some trend line to see the pattern. This is the upper trend line. This is the lower trend line. So at this point, we're still not sure, even though we can draw a trend line, bottom trend line here, but we don't know whether the market is going down further. And then we wait a little bit until we see this consecutive bull bars here, and then it, it is breaking the um, top trend line greatly. You can see the tail here, very big. And then it goes down, but it's not going down further and then going back up. So the first trading opportunity is here, is this bar. This bar could serve as a signal bar. The reason that this bar can serve as a signal bar for buy opportunity is because first, this bar is huge breaking the trend line and ignore the trend line. So it's a breakthrough. Whenever something is breaking, there's a good opportunity following and then there could be a trend after that. And then this is a pullback here for the bear bar and then with this uh, bull bar as well. Take a look at this bull bar. So it, the uh, body account for more than 50% of the uh, whole bar and the top tail is small and uh, the bottom tail is big. So this is a perfect uh, signal bar for the uh, buy opportunity. So that's why this is the first buy signal. Enter half a pip on top of the uh, high of this bar, and then you can put your stop below the low of this if you're conservative. And then if you are a little bit aggressive, you can put your stop maybe below this. That's gonna be too much for beginners. Then that means you're waiting for trending or swing your trade rather than scalping. After we enter the trade, there's another follow-up bull bar, which is a confirmation of the uh, trend. And then it follows with another bear bar, and then another bull bar. So at this point of time, this bull bar is another very good buy signal. So if you miss the first buy signal here, you can take a trade after this bar is finished, and then put your entry order above the high of this bull bar. Uh, one good thing you can notice is that if the trend is strong, you can see that your order will be triggered right after you put your order and then in by the next bar. So you're in the trade in the next bar here. And then the trend goes down a little bit here. It is a pullback. And then you can see the tail here of this bear bar, why it is going down uh, at this level, it is because it's going to test the uh, your first buy entry level here. Because other traders, they sometimes they do the uh, reverse thinking, that they know that this is where you enter your trade. So they want to go down to test and then drive you out of the market. However, it was not successful because it never reached uh, the top of this bull bar and then it goes back. So the third good buy signal bar is this bull bar. You can see that the, uh, the body here accounts for more than 50% of the uh, whole bar and um, the top and the bottom, the tails are not very big. You can see that right after you put your order at top of this bull bar, the next bar will trigger your order so you're in a trade now. So these are the very good opportunities for this chart. So if you take any of them, you're making profit. Another thing is to measure the uh, leg up. So 
if we treat this as the first leg up, let's do a measure. And then for the second leg up, we can start with this bull bar because it goes up consecutively. Let's see what happened. So in the end, the market reaches the top of here. That means it follows a measured move. Hope you enjoy the video. Thank you.